hear from the word of God today that today is the day of your salvation. From the dust we came, to the dust we returned. And one day we will stand before God. And we will answer for the decisions that we made and that we made in our lives. Do you know Jesus? Jesus loves you, my friends. Do you know him? The Bible says that unless we repent, we will perish in our sins. I want you to know that God has created us, formed us in His two hands for a reason, for a purpose, to give us life and life more abundantly. Read your Bible and pray, little beings. God wants to lift this country up and bring the fire of revival. You were created for a purpose and God loves you. God is faithful, my friends, to do so much more than you could ever ask for think. Cry out to God and He will hear your voice. He will give you strength in time of need. He will bless you if you are faithful to Him. The Bible says we must be born again. We are born again when we call upon the name of Jesus, confessing us Lord. God will put His Spirit inside of your hearts and He will give you life and life more abundantly. There is no peace outside of Jesus. He is the name of every day. The salvation of God is ready to be poured out upon this country. I bless you. I love you. I want you to know that God loves you. But we must call upon the name of the Lord. We must repent and find the salvation of God through surrender. Give yourself to the Lord today, my friends. Hear the word of the Lord. He loves you. There is only one name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved is Jesus. Jesus. Do you know Jesus? Does He know you? Does God live in your heart? Do you belong to Him? There is power in His name to work the burdens of your soul. To give life, peace, and direction. You can find peace today. You can know the salvation of God. My friends, I've been through so much in my life. I know what it feels like at the bottom of life's pit. I know what it feels like to be alone, to not have answers, to lack peace. I know what it's like to hurt. I know what it's like to cry as the weariness or the burdens of my soul swallowed me up. I know that when I called upon the name of Jesus, my life changed. I know that when I ran to God, and I said, God, I can't do this anymore by myself. I need you. That my whole life changed. And he gave me a purpose. And now I travel all over the world, and I preach the gospel of Christ so that those who are hurting can feel the touch of God. So many people are hurting. You have a purpose and a destiny. And God wants to use you to reach somebody near to you. People in your family, they need a healing touch. They need to know what hope feels like. And your story, your testimony can be the light in their darkness that they need. Speak through us, oh God. Help us to be a light for you in the midst of darkness. If you want to know Jesus, please come. We will pray with you. Do you know Jesus, ladies? Does Jesus know you? When you die, do you know where you will be in eternity? Your soul that is in your body is eternal. But when you die, your body goes back to the dust of the earth, but your soul goes somewhere. Your soul will go to heaven or hell. Do you know Jesus? We must repent for our sins. Repentance means that sin and pleasures of this life is this way, Jesus is this way. We turn away from the world and we follow Jesus. We say, Jesus, I want you. I encourage you today, my friends, call upon his name and he will be faithful. Father God, I pray that you will pour out your spirit 
right here, right now. I pray that you would move in our midst. I pray that you would draw hearts and minds towards you. And you would help us, oh God, to be your instruments of righteousness, to be vessels sanctified and set apart for your good use, oh God. Bring the harvest in the Philippines, oh God. We love you very much. We glorify you right now in Jesus' name.